Hey, welcome to today's reading. Let's pray. Father, I pray for today. Lord, we thank you for a new week. And Father, we pray that whatever we read today, Lord, your life and healing will speak to us today. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. So today I'm reading from Luke chapter 4, verse 38 to 44. All right, let's read. So Jesus left the synagogue and went to the home of Simon. Now Simon's mother-in-law was suffering from a high fever and they asked Jesus to help her. So he bent over and rebuked the fever. And so he left her. She got up at once and began to wait on them. Notice she got healed immediately. When the sun was setting, the people brought to Jesus all who had various kinds of sicknesses and laying his hands on each one, and he healed them, every single one of them. Moreover, demons came out of many people shouting, You are the Son of God. But he rebuked them and could not allow them to speak, because they knew he was the Christ, basically the Messiah. At daybreak, Jesus went out to a solitary place, and the people were looking for him. And when they came to where he was, he tried to keep him from leaving them, but he said, I must preach the good news to the kingdom of God, to the other towns also, because that is why I was sent. And he kept on preaching to the synagogues of Judea. Amen. So, in Jesus' ministry, and Jesus' time, and now even, right, as you read here, Jesus healed many people, right? And that's what I believe too. In fact, right now, my wife is currently having a fever too. And I believe the Lord will heal her as well. And I also a little bit not feeling well as well. And that's where faith comes in. Alright. But in reality set in, sometimes in ministry we pray, you know, and we do see people not healed. Alright. So does everyone I pray in Jesus' name get healed? Well, most of them do. <laughs> right, and I believe every one of them will get healed. So I, I always ask God, you know, why, why are days now when we pray, you know, we are not being healed, right? And God respond back to me is, according to my time, not yours, right? So when He told me that, right, I knew immediately He was trying to tell me that you must learn to submit to Him. You see, we are not God. I'm not God too. Right? We cannot demand God to do things that we want. Doesn't mean we ask for something, God will give. God can say no too. Right? And sometimes God will ask you to wait. And there's reason behind it also. But do we see people get healed when we pray in the name of Jesus immediately? Yes, I do. Right? I do see that many, many times uh, when I serve God. And that's one good reminder for all of us that Jesus healed many people. It's immediate. And Jesus also had the authority to heal demons out of people, which I have seen in my own eyes uh, as well. Another good reminder of this verse is that he's been called right, to send, to say the good news to everyone. So on top of healing people, Jesus also encouraged us to also share the good news to everyone, just like what I'm doing right now. So I want to pray with you, especially if you're sick, and I pray for my wife too and myself. Let's all pray and believe together that Jesus will heal us. Amen. Father, we want to ask right now in the name of Jesus, whoever is sick, watching this video, listening to this video, we command healing right now in the name of Jesus. Lord, heal me from my tiredness and so a bit of cough. Father, I pray also for my wife who has high fever and also cough as well. Heal her right now in the name of Jesus. Lord, my friends who are watching this video, my family and members who are in the hospital as well who have cancer we command healing for the cancer to be gone right now in the name of Jesus Father, those who have leg pain who are pain to be gone right now in the name of Jesus and Father, those who are <coughs> hurts and betrayers we command healing spiritual healing and emotional healing as well in the name of Jesus Thank you Lord Father for hearing our prayer and Lord may your testament be made in our lives Thank you, Lord Father, for hearing our prayer. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. If you believe as I believe, 
comment, email below and we believe together. I hope you enjoyed this sharing so far. Do remember to follow me as I share daily as well and know that we are praying with you as well and believing together with you that Jesus will heal you. Amen.